Do you have some ideas about what this project is that we're working on out back? Good morning, guys, and welcome to another episode of Bubba's Garage. If you guys have been following our last couple of videos, we've been having a lot of things going on here in Bubba's Garage lately. Fish Aquarium is definitely not doing too well. Not exactly sure why. It definitely left us sleepless last night. And we got a huge project that we're fixing to start out back, and that is not going well at all. I have another contractor that I have to meet this afternoon, so I have to get a lot of work done outside and get a lot of stuff moved around. Meanwhile, this morning, Bobby and I are trying to find our little clownfish and we can't find him. I don't think he survived the night. Yesterday's video, if you saw that, then you know that things were not going really well at all. I can't figure out what's going on with this aquarium, but I'm going to do a 50% cycle change on it just for the heck of it because I don't know what else to do. We got to find that little fella. I hope that he's not dead, but I think that's where we're headed with this. So, um, this is not going to be a very friendly day today, but I'm going to do my best to look up and be bright and shiny and change the outcome. Somehow, some way, that's what we're going to do. The world is your oyster. Don't be upset if you fail. Keep trying. Keep trying. Keep thinking you can do it. And you will get there. You can do it. So now, do you have some ideas about what this project is that we're working on out back? I'm not gonna lie guys, we built this house three years ago with a plan for back there, but we were focused on the front first, and now we're headed back there. So let me know what you think it is that we're doing back there. It's a major project and I'm not gonna lie, we're running into a lot of obstacles and probably won't get it the way we wanna get it, but that's okay. We're gonna do the best we can with what we got and see where it takes us. Side note, 50% water change has been done. Everything looks good, but then again, it did look good before. And like everything else here in Bubba's Garage, the aquarium is part of a bigger plan, a much, much bigger plan. If you haven't noticed already, there's one 55 gallon tank here. There is another here. So everything that we do with one tank, we do for another, it is part of a bigger plan. So everything that we're doing here, we have to do times two. Now, well, I think Shelby needs me to look at homework. So be, be right back. Homework went really, really well. She's only got three problems left. So she's definitely on the downhill side. And huge, huge plus. I just got confirmation that my 50-50 bulbs have shipped. Now, please note, my 50-50 bulbs are temporary solutions. Why are they temporary solutions? Real quick and simple, guys. I have four. 165 watt LED system that I need to install here Four. So each tank is going to get two of those. Problem is I can't put them on the tank. The reason for that is this canopy has to be completely rebuilt. I don't know if you guys have followed the entire aquarium build, but Bobby and I built this entire aquarium stand, the canopy, the whole nine yards from scratch. I'll leave a link to that there in the eye in the sky. So what's gonna happen here, a future project right here on Bubba's Garage, all the other projects going on, yes, we have a future project right here on Bubba's Garage, and that is Bobby and I have to build a new canopy. And the canopy actually has to be taller, the whole nine yards, and it has to support the weight of those LED lights because they're like eight pounds a piece. So you do the math. That's four of them. That is definitely coming to a future episode right here on Bubba's Garage. Right now, I think I need to start cooking dinner. All right, guys. It's been a really rough couple of days. And I mean, really rough. I mean, saltwater aquarium problems and I, 
you know, it's very unfortunate. We lost three fish, two clowns and a tang. We only have one Danzel left. The parameters on the aquarium have been great. Uh, there's nothing wrong with those parameters. I probably didn't even have to do a 50% water change, but I did. I, I just didn't know what else to do. Maybe there's something I couldn't test for. With that said, we, we have a huge outdoor project that we're working on, and this is a very huge project. Things aren't going the way we want them to go at all. Just run into a lot of obstacles. Engineers are looking at this and, and telling me that, you know, you, you, you got a major problem here. To do what you want to do, um, you're going you're gonna to have to build another house. Um, this is just not gonna work. And uh, so we're going we're making some changes on that today. Um, I actually uh, hired a contractor to move forward on some of this project. So here in the next couple days, you guys are gonna see some of that. We're really excited about that. We've been waiting on this for about three years. So I'm kind of stoked. Um, I just got through slaving over dinner. And uh, now it's time to end my day. I'm tired, I'm exhausted, Bobby's home. We're gonna relax the rest of the evening. So I hope you guys like this video. If you do, please give us a huge, huge thumbs up. And if you really like this video and you wanna stick around and find out what happens next, right here on Bubba's Garage, please subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you on the flip side. Good night, everybody. Right now, I'm gonna sit down and eat. I'm kinda of exhausted, I'm really burnt out. I'm stressed out, I'm concerned, I'm worried, I'm paranoid, I'm afraid.